guys, Synergy here, and I'm bringing you a brand new high-ranked attrition gameplay for you. And we're going to get into this gameplay now, and basically, we're on the loading screen, so, yeah, sorry about the wait, guys. <laughs> uh, feel free, you can fast-forward it a little bit, I don't actually mind people doing that as well. Uh, just feel free to watch the videos the whole way through, guys, and enjoy the gameplay. Um, yeah, so, we're going to get into it. <coughs> Got a little bit of a groggy throat today because I've been doing a lot of commenting for you, and um, there's going to be a lot of videos coming for you guys. So yeah, be prepared for that as well. And yeah, this time we're actually playing Colony Attrition. You can see I've got fast learning, decisive action, which is the 40 seconds of fill time. That's the one I'm going to use to start with. And we have the aerial okay. implants as well. First one on the ground. They have eyes on the distress signal coordinates. What do you see, three two? Anything by the tower? Nothing. The tower looks abandoned. We got do, 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 do. Eventually, no we'll get got into it. it. Come on, let's get here. going. Um, right, so you're going to see one of the main routes that I actually use. Um, sometimes I will change these routes up depending on the opponent. Um, but this is the fastest way you can rack up those attrition points straight off the marker. Um, you can see I actually make a little bit of a mistake there. I was meant to wall glide on that one. Use the double art grenades there and we get a nice little pack over here. So we're going to take a lot of them out. And unfortunately, I am surrounded by an absolute absolute army of spectres um, and as you know spectres they're not the easiest to take out and I'm taking a lot of damage from them as well at the same time right so just doubling back on myself we're gonna take out some more spectres there and there's a guy camping in that building and yeah this time we're gonna end up using the aureole implant and um, we're gonna get straight back into the action so I'm not actually going for the pilot kill straight away and um, so I do might pick up a few deaths along the way but yeah it's one of those we're actually playing the game type and it's not pilot hunting so grunts and spectres do count towards it as well you can see me jump kick that guy to the face with a son of a mace and we've got my titan in already and you can actually see the attrition points on the scoreboard there just to show you how quick you can actually build up these points and you can see you little jerk who was riding me at the minute he's one of my teammates and these are people that I've met online and basically we start creating teams like that and we go dominate the public and stuff um, but we don't we do not do it to sort of embarrass people or anything like that it's just games, there'll be games that we actually do lose and it's very rare that we do actually lose um, obviously it depends on the opponent as well and how many we've got in the party usually we lose when we've got say two people on there and they've got full plans against us and stuff like that um, that's just because it's a bit unbalanced and simple as that you can't really do all the work for the other opponents that are on well the other teammates that are actually on your team so you can see me get the level up there nice and fast and we're just going on a crushing spree we're not going to waste too much time shooting the spectres because it isn't one of our challenges at the minute so we can just play this one and have a little bit of fun with it I actually use the rocket salvo as well just to take them out a little bit quicker and you can see I'm being attacked by a titan which is not a good position for me because I've got no shields so I'm going to get the hell out of there and then we end up running into another titan right so next we end up taking that titan out and we're going to be forced into the eject And we're just going to finish off that titan as well because that's going to give us a nice 5 attrition point and it's going to give us one of our sidewinder challenges which is like the titan killers nice and easy and there you go we get another sidewinder challenge as well and we've got another titan over here that one's already in doom mode so we're not going to pick up the sidewinder challenge for that one and you're just going to see me working around there you go, I actually get taken out on that one. Right, so we're bringing in our final burn card, which is the Fast Learner, and we're just going to see how much XP we can get from this gameplay. It is a high ranked attrition gameplay, guys, so it's not going to be completely flawless. Um, obviously, I will bring you flawless gameplays, which is high ranked as well. 
but it's not going to be like that all the time. Um, and so I'm bringing you the gameplays as they come, guys. And simple as that, that way I'm able to bring you a lot more content. You're able to sort of learn from what I do and then obviously add your own ways of doing it. And basically, you can make it play completely differently, use different weapons, different tactics. You may, for example, camp in a building, you may be running around on roofs. Oh, you may be running around on the ground. So there we go, we get eyes on this guy on the roof. That's a nice easy kill for us. We've got the chain gun in our hands and it is a beast for taking out pilots. Well, pilots that aren't in the Titans, it is a beast for that. And you can pretty much take out Titans pretty damn fast in it as well. There you go, we get eyes on another one and we get the killing spree, headshot and dominate. So that Titan shields are down, but there's another Titan attacking me, but it turns out to be an auto Titan. So what we're going to do is we're going to take that out in a second. We're just going to rack up some more attrition points for you. We've got a pilot lock in. We need to get out of the way there. There you go. There he is. Hello. Okay, killing spree again, and the pilot assist again. So we've got something else that's hitting us. So we're just going to back off that one, regen our shield, and just play it nice and smart. We actually go for a goose around that one, but we end up not getting it because it's got the auto eject auto cloak. So I couldn't really see him through the smoke as well. I'm going to run voice analysis. It's going to take a little more time. Okay, so let's go and finish off this auto titan. As we finish it off, you actually see a guy jump up there, which is a pilot, who's going to be trying to rodeo. And basically, I've got eyes on him right here, and there you go, we stop the rodeo. So that's the teamwork aspect of it, guys. You do want to work as a team, and also, you do want to be able to warn at the same time, because if you want to level up fast, then um, you basically got to do the best that you can do. You can see a guy rodeo there, he actually jumps up onto here. And there you go, it goes back onto the rodeo which allows me to take him out. And we actually get the rampage there and headshot. <laughs> so we're on a killing spree anyway, that's more to the point. Right, so it's 225 to 171. And we're just gonna take out that pilot on the ground there before we end up smoking there because our shields were going down. What we're gonna actually do is we're gonna challenge this Titan because we got the dash car. He's used the smoke, so we're not going to go through that smoke because that'll take your shields down very, very fast. And that's exactly why I use it as well. Um, you can see my Titan's actually going to be taken out here. So we're going to be forced to eject. And unfortunately, I get Titan punch on that one. So we're on 103 attrition points for you at the minute, guys. We're going to see how many more we can rack up. We've got 75 more points to go, so every time we go into Spectre gets killed, that's obviously adding to the attrition. Point, and that's from the whole team as well. And we get taken out in the battler. Right, so we're not going to be sort of disheartened by that, and we're just going to get straight back into the action. And you can see, just adding a bit of random damage onto those titans, and somebody next next time. Okay, so we're actually on a death spree at the minute, guys. Um, so, 103, and obviously my points haven't gone up yet because I've just died a hell of a lot, which is unusual for me. Um, yeah, but I left myself nice and all for them, so we were able to get the kills. You can see they've got a lot of titans up to take out these pilots on the roof here which allows our pilots to get eyes on them. I'm going to use the Sidewinder just to take out as many of these Titans as I can. I've got my Titan to bring in as well. I'm going to take out that one, and uh, while he's on that low health, we're just going to finish him off with that, and then we're going to embark in it, so we get the level up again. Human player, boom. Okay, so we're back on killing. Woohoo! Hunting these pilots down, we end up crushing Nelios. Now, Nelios actually reminds me of a name like Helios. Uh, I think it's actually is it from Family Guy, that one. 
No, 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 it's American Dad. Yeah. Uh, oh, it's the one where Stan gets beaten up by his bullet. Okay, so that gives us the win, guys. 300 to 245. You can see the 141 attrition points, 17 kills. I think it was 5 or 6 deaths, though. We'll see that in a second, anyway. And we're just going to get onto the dropship part. What you're going to see me do is see this guy right here. There we go. He's obviously hiding. We came to answer your distress signal. I repeat, identify yourself. This is James McCallan, former of the IMC. You want to help? You come Incoming dropship. I have a lot of survivors here that need an evac. Hold on. There you go. Right, so that's the dropship, and we're just going to run as much damage as we can onto this. I actually bring in the smoke just in case, and we end up taking him out very fast. And we get the level up from the dropship as well. Showstopper, rampage, evacuation denied. All these challenges, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe the videos. As you can see, we're against the G6, G4, and G3. And the other two are unranked players. And we've got three in our party, which are highlighted there.